Uh, I'm a chartered engineer. I obtained my chartership with NAL uh, last year. And basically, from that point, after getting my chartership, the next logical step was when this program became available to uh, go for this, as you're encouraged, basically, as a chartered engineer to um, continue to improve professionally and to um, improve your skills and build upon your engineering skills. For the, the project idea itself, it's something that we can potentially develop and, and move forward with to become a commercial product for to, to sell to industry. The fact that I'm able to do my studies alongside my full-time work in-house was, was a perfect opportunity for me. NEL has um, a major uh, flow facility. Um, it's quite a, a big facility, so they basically we have to share that facility with customers, researchers, and now this engineering doctorate um, um, programme. My employer is very flexible, so when, whenever I, I need to use, we're a, a test and calibration facility, so whenever I need to use a certain facility, they're very flexible and I can manoeuvre this around commercial jobs, uh, which is a huge bonus. It's good for, for my own career, for networking with other well, real world uh, companies. Uh, and other engineers, but also it gives us good feedback because I've, I might have a certain idea based on my own working uh, practices, but as soon as you start discussing that with other individuals, that's where you start to get generate different ideas and look at alternative routes you could possibly take the project. I've currently drafted three papers uh, involved using the course. I've travelled all over the world. I've been to uh, Southeast Asia, I've been to Texas, I've uh, and I'm meant to be going to, to Canada next month. Uh, and that's all linked through the, the NGD programme. So it's an excellent opportunity to, to network with people as, as, well as, as well as see the world. The facility I've chosen to use for my particular research um, had to be upgraded to accommodate the kind of tests that I'm required to do. Um, so as such, um, they've, they've now got a, a more efficient facility which is capable of making um, um, more traceable measurements. In terms of the, the lectures and the, the modules and uh, directors of studies and things like that, everyone's, uh, everyone's very nice people, they're always happy to help. And particularly with the directors of studies, the guys are, they've been working in industry for, for decades, so they're very experienced people. So it's, it's good to have that sort of background uh, to, be, to rely on. I have three named supervisors, all with different backgrounds, so um, that's also very helpful because you get different perspectives on different aspects of the research. The Coventry University support is really good. Um, my professor is really helpful and goes above and beyond the, the academic side of things. Even I, I find I'm getting additional support even beyond the, the domain of Coventry. I think it's been a, a great course for us so far, even just in our, our first year. Just learning new skills and, and techniques, particularly on report writing, which will help my my career and uh, my, my work no end. Uh, and just being able to continually develop your, your own skills and qualities is, is quite an asset, I think. I think it's a, a great um, course if you want to improve your, your skills, um, both professionally and technically. Um, it's a great experience overall. It's, it's an excellent opportunity for, for anyone who's just came out of uni or perhaps have been in their job for a while and they want to do something different, do a little bit of research. It's, it's just the, the flexibility of it and the support that you get, the level of support. Uh, I've got so many contacts now at Coventry University in so many different areas.